Hi, it's a lady. How y'all doing? It's a lady, baby. I just want to say, hey, what's up? How I'm doing me 24 7 days a week. Hi. How y'all doing? And y'all please subscribe to my channel before we get started. So you can see me again. I'm going to talk to y'all It's LA Baby Granny 618. I got a little read for my Libras. Okay. Are you ready? I want y'all to like, share this video so we can get around. We're going to talk about your January 2nd to the to the 31st, Libra. I hope you enjoy. So, the card that came out for you for first was the Eight of Coins. Um, bear with me. The Eight of Coins in the reverse. This card is a decrease in your money. You might have low money, less hours, and possible layoffs. So don't be all upset because, you know, things happen. It's going to get better because God don't make no mistakes. He will fix the problem. Then you have the emperor, the empress, I mean, in the reverse, honesty and full disclosure about it. You're not lying about it because some people think you're full of shit and you're telling the truth. And if any kids, please get off. I'm sorry because I cuss sometimes and I don't want to cause no problems. Let's go to the next card. You have the eight of staffs in the reverse. Like I said, loss of wealth and position as a result of excessive vanity. You're using too much. You're using too much. You're not taking your money wisely. You're using it in vain. And what happens with that is the more money you lose that you got to put in, you got to save for a rainy day because this is a rainy day. This month right here, I would be careful about spending all the money because they hope you do. So therefore, you could be suffering. So don't spend all your money and you don't have nothing for the next day, okay? The next, you got the Page of Swords in the reverse. The Page of Swords in the reverse. Hold on, y'all. Just one second. Um, The Page of Swords. I had it. It's gossiping contract. I thought so. Some people are gossiping about you, talking about you. And then there's a contract that somebody might want you to sign, but you need to read it very carefully. Because it's always people try to trick people and use people and take people's money. So don't get yourself caught up in that. I'm going to take what you owe and you're broke and you're back where you started. And then you... You know, other things happen. So be careful about your money. Then you have the five of staff in the reverse. Uh, this is a complete dispute, verbal, legal, deception, inquiries. Something legal or deception that you have completed. You've done what you're supposed to do and you completed it and you're done and you should be proud of yourself. Now you have the 10 of staffs in the reverse. Emotional drama, difficulty, uh, intro deception. You're going through some emotional drama. You don't know how to handle it. It's pissing you off. It's putting you in another state of stake. But don't do it. Don't let nobody destroy you, Libra. Enjoy your life because life is short. You got one or two, but you know you may got three, but you can keep coming back here. You're going to keep correcting what you do wrong because you're going to get it right eventually. Then you got the six of staffs in the upright. You might expect some good news concerning the decision to your fate that you have on your work. It's going to pay off from victory in the end. Okay. But then you got the wheel of fortune in the reverse. Unable to move forward, delays and disappointments. You let your delays and disappointments get in your life and take over. Don't do that. Don't let delays and disappointments take over your life where you, you're angry, pissed off. Then you have the three of coins in the upright. Um, this is maybe a, a time, some time to get what you want. There will be much need to work on your skills to succeed. The world is getting more demanding 
It takes a lot more to get what you want than what you used to. But once you get it and you master it, Libra, it's nothing. It's nothing. You can do it. You just have to believe that you can. That's a lot of the problem in life. Then you have the Ten of Cups in the reverse. There's a smiling faces, actions that do not match the words spoken. A warning. Pay close attention to this person. Because this person is full of shit. Excuse my friends. In the reverse, they're full of shit. Okay? Straight up. I'm going to put it that simple and leave it alone. <laughs> okay? Then you got the queen of staffs in the upright. A very strong, uh, loving person. Very responsible and caring individual. You can be trusted, this person says. Then you have the Ten of Coins. Okay, we get into the good stuff. We get into the good life, okay? The Tens of Coins um, in the upright is concerning a time to be um, concerned about your um, home, family, financial, economic stability. You know, it's a time for happiness surrounding your home. Remember your family in whatever you do. Your family is where your blessings are at so right now. Where you get your blessings because you're putting in the work. Okay, then you have the Ace of Swords, but the Ace of Swords is in the reverse. It's a time to, it's for a new birth, a pregnancy. Someone could be pregnant or something going on. You're getting noticed about it. This month, you might be a daddy. Or you might be hearing about it, somebody having it. One way or another. There's something like that going on. Then you got the Knight of Staffs in the room straight up. You may be taking a trip soon over long distance. Now is a good time to change where you live if you want to find your new location. It would be all, all good. It's the perfect time. Then you have the Page of Staffs. In the reverse, your vision, you need to seek after material. You're just a workaholic sometimes and scartastic. You don't have to be scartastic about everything. It's not necessary. Then you have the two of swords, which was in the reverse. Um, empty words, insecurity, actions, and lies. You feel like somebody's lying to you. And you're probably right. <laughs> um, the emperor in the reverse generosity and manipulated somebody's manipulating that ass <laughs> that's shocking Libra <laughs> very shocking then you got the magician in the reverse doctor, mental illness, shame upset, unwillingness to act look like some of you got some mental issues that you need to address you need to go, oh, there's too many pills out there. There's too many therapies. There's things you can do. You don't got to sit there and be all depressed and hanging, sitting up there living your life with not happy and letting your emotional and your mental stuff because it, it can mess up your life. It's not necessary. You don't have to let things like that mess you up. There's always something you can do to fix it. There's no reason to be unhappy. Just remember that. Then you got the tempers in the reverse. You're frustrated, you're anger, your failure to accomplish your goals. You feel like I'm just angry, but you need to stop that anger stuff because it ain't getting you nowhere. Anger ain't gonna solve the problem. At the end of the day, you still got the same problem that you're angry about. Then you got the sun card in the reverse. This could be a time of being happy but you're not going to be happy because it's in the reverse. You're kind of upset. You're sad. You're letting life, your drama, your life, your mental status interrupt your happiness. Don't do it. It's not necessary, Libra. It's not necessary. I hope y'all enjoyed the reading. And that's for January 2nd to the 31st of 2021. I hope everybody had a good New Year's and everything. And thank y'all for joining me. Like, share so this video can get around. I appreciate y'all watching or taking that time out to watch. God bless you all. 
And y'all have the best in life that life can give you. Bye-bye, <laughs> y'all.